In this video, I'm going to demonstrate nutation examination of the sacroiliac joint. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. We already discussed sacroiliac joint dysfunction in our videos on the Gillette and standing bent over test. Watch those videos by a click in the top right corner. The manual technique to assess nutation of the sacrum is used to get information on movement in the SI joint, though there is little available, and feel and possible pain provocation. Okay, here we see the sacrum from the back and we're going to divide the sacrum into four quadrants. You can see there is cranial caudal left and right and what we do is we draw a horizontal line through sacral level S2, which is the pivoting point of the sacrum. And then we have quadrant one in the top left, quadrant two in the top right, and quadrant three is in the bottom left, and quadrant four is in the bottom right. This will later on determine where we place our hands for the different techniques. To test nutation, have the patient in prone lying position. Place a pillar under the patient's anterior superior iliac spine on the side you want to examine. You are going to stand on the asymptomatic side and place the hand corresponding to the SI joint you want to examine on the sacrum. In the case of the right SI joint, this is the right hand in quadrant 2. For the left, it would be your left hand in quadrant 1. Place your other hand on top and then apply a force in cranioventral direction and slight lateral and assess for joint play or end feel. Okay, this was our video on nutation examination. Make sure to watch more videos on SI joint assessment by clicking right next to me and don't forget to like this video. And if you're new here, make sure to subscribe. This was Andreas for PhysioTutors. I'll see you next time. Bye.